Let's go to Virgil. He's in Ohio listening online. Hello, Virgil. Uh, good evening, guys. How are oh, you? Hey, good. What's on your mind tonight? Well, I'm calling uh, to talk to you guys about a, uh, a fairly well-known shooting that took place not far from my house, actually, here in uh, in Ohio. Oh, no. It was kind of all over the yeah, it was all over the news. Uh, it happened about four nights ago, where a 22-year-old black man was shopping at a Walmart. Apparently, he was shopping for uh, some sort of an air rifle or a BB gun of sorts. Oh, and, man, uh, I heard about this. Yeah, and as he was uh, apparently just messing with a gun and trying to uh, figure out how it worked, yeah, I assume it was just normal activity uh, that you know someone goes through you know before purchasing an item to mm-hmm. study it and look at it. Uh, someone apparently decided to call 911 to report him as being suspicious and uh, carrying a, a rifle in Walmart. Uh, a lot of panic was created, and, and two cops basically showed up, and they uh, they basically killed this man. Wow. Uh, yeah, Tell and uh, to, it's terrible. It's, a, it's very tragic. Um, and what happened to, to add to that, as, as people were freaking out after the shots uh, from the police rang out, uh, one woman attempting to run away from the store, she had a heart attack, and she also oh. unfortunately died. Wow. Um, so this is tragic on so many fronts, and uh, uh, there there is some some uh, indication that uh, he was on the phone while the cops, uh, you know, came from behind him and asked him to drop the gun. And then mm. I, it, it seems like they only gave him a couple of seconds to react, uh, and then they shot him as he was turning around towards them. So it, uh, you know, he even told them the gun is not real because the person he was on the oh. phone with uh, he heard him saying so. Um, so That's this crazy. is tragic, and uh, and the Dayton Cop uh, Cop Block guys are scheduling a protest tomorrow morning at ten thirty uh, at Walmart in Beaver Creek. So if anyone is listening and wants to join us, uh, by all means, we need your support. So Dayton Cop Block, uh, very cool, Virgil. I guess keep us in the loop with uh, what transpires there. And when I say very cool, we'll I mean only the protest part, the shooting part, not cool. Uh, thanks for the call tonight. Toll free number eight fifty five four fifty free. You take control here. Free Talk Live, seven nights a week from 7 to 10 Eastern, live on the Liberty Radio Network at lrn.fm.